So two are to become non-racist. Um, first, the accurate knowledge and pride of their own identity. A lot of white people we do, we teach a um, diversity class here at PC Super Early Childhood. Students are required to. And one of the things that we do in my class is everybody in the class has to do a cultural presentation. They have to bring in artifacts about their own culture and share it with the rest of the class. And they're powerful. Some of them will do PowerPoints. They'll bring in recipes and food from their families. And the white people always say, I don't have a culture. That's part of the power. I don't have a culture. Because I'm normal. That's another word we need to talk about is normalcy. It's normal to be white in the United States. That's the norm. And that that's very unhealthy. How do you handle the issue of pride and whiteness? So they have to honor where they came from. So if they came from, you know, they're all probably European. So Italian families in German, they can celebrate their own German. But the point is, because it's important for the white people to say they have a culture, yeah. because that if they, if they don't have a culture, then that means that we are the dominant people. We don't need a culture. Because we're, we're, we're normal. Mm -hmm. We're normal, but other people have cultures. Mm -hmm. And that's why we have to have them come in. And they have a hard time they thinking. Have a hard time. Yeah, I'm trying to find yeah. Realize that they have a culture, mm -hmm. so they have to they have to celebrate where they their roots are from, mm -hmm. Germany or France or whatever. But that's interesting, isn't it? Mm -hmm. 